The National Film Board was created to share perspectives of Canadians to Canadians and the world, and it can be a critical part of a filmmaker's career. But a new report says the NFB isn't doing enough for black and racialized filmmakers. An independent group looked at directors hired over the past decade and found when NFB set targets for gender equity... In 2016, and they exceeded it, 50% would go to women. And when the NFB focused on Indigenous filmmakers... I think in 2019 they made a commitment of 15% for the Indigenous filmmakers, which they exceeded as well. But when it comes to working with black and racialized filmmakers, the NFB has made pledges, but set no targets. For five out of ten years, black directors had only one or no films produced by the NFB. And Asian directors only made up 8% of films. When you have a guiding light to guide you, the chances of, of achieving that goal is much higher. Joan Jenkinson has been battling for better tracking info for years. So if you try asking, like the NFB, I would like to see a spreadsheet of how many black filmmakers you've used in the past decade. Do they have that information? The NFB um, promised in 2021 uh, in a report that they were committed to collecting data. And to date, we've seen nothing. A little shocked, maybe. Um, I mean, it's uh, it's sad to see that, that the numbers are that dismal. This I filmmaker who says the NFB has been very supportive was surprised. When they do make projects with us, you know, I think it's, it's a positive experience. I think we just need more. After the report was released, the NFB told the CBC they did meet with the authors. The report's author says the NFB has now made a commitment to setting targets, but... Words are just words until they're put into actions. He says it's now up to Heritage Canada to ensure the NFB turns promise into action. Eli Glaster, CBC News, Toronto.